back with another video. Uh, it seems that uh, King Phone, they said it, that he supposedly died after a shooting. They said it was an altercation with Quando Rondo or his crew. I don't know if Quando Rondo was there or so. But you know, I have a few things to say about it, but I just want to watch the newest clip. I'll get into it little, little, in a little bit. So. What led up to four shot overnight in downtown Atlanta? Two of them died, and now investigators are working to figure out what led up to the violence. Good as Emily Iketa has been following the story for us all morning, and she joins us live with the latest. Emily. Ali, still a heavy police presence on scene. Some six hours since the police shooting, just because of how complicated and, frankly, deadly of an incident this has been. Now, this all started with an argument between two large groups of people, according to police, outside of a club here on Trinity Avenue. Investigators say that became physical, and then guns were drawn. Things escalating quickly from there. Police say the group started shooting at each other, despite an APD patrol car parked with its lights on in their line of sight. Two off-duty officers were working a side job in the area, so they were quickly able to try to intervene, but police say that did not stop the gunfire. We're told both officers fired their weapons. As you mentioned, five people were shot, two of those individuals died, and one is in critical condition. Now investigators can't say for certain that the officers actually struck any of the five people, but they say it is highly likely. It's also that those groups fired directly at the officers, though they were notably not injured. Here's APD on the chaotic overnight shooting. Take a listen. There were two off-duty officers who were there working in a uniform capacity and uh, of which one of them was actually inside his patrol car or next to his patrol car with his blue lights on. So uh, visibility was there, but again, unfortunately, the incident happened. And so uh, we're hopeful that with the uh, GBI's assistance, we can get to the bottom of everything. The thing what 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 gets to me is that you know I'm not gonna be that one of those guys who say, oh watch for this dude after that situation. But the thing what gets to me is y'all make it from the bottom. Y'all ain't wealthy, but y'all able to be a little rich to so you get yourself with the situation. None of these guys were from this area. All of them from separate areas. They come to this one area to still bring, to still bring that foolishness in Atlanta. Like serious, Chicago and Louisiana, you, that's where y'all from. And y'all come to Atlanta to do that? Like come on man. At a certain point you gotta like, like, like say, it's not the environment. It's the people. If you, it's the people. Because the people make the environment that way. And, you know, I I just don't understand it. Like, if you are, uh, I guess it's just a mindset. You know, sometimes things just bring you back. Like, you just can't let things go. Like, maybe me, some people just think different than me. But for me, if I was, if I was these guys and I made money, I don't care. They did the right thing, which was move over to their city because, you know, things happen but the, the the thing is you move to go do foolishness in another state like think about this you move from where you was you live in nice with plus sheets probably the top floor or close to the top floor in a good apartment you wearing Gucci or whatever you want to wear that is high price and you still want to go back to the bottom to go beef with people? Come on, man. You got to be stupid. Like, like, listen, it's comical. You, listen, bro. You can take a person out of the hood, but you can't take the hood out of the person. Listen, dog. Some guys got the memo, but very few do. Like, I just don't understand it. I really don't. I really don't. I guess it's just, you know, that's what their music is based off. That's what their fame is based off. So they have to uphold themselves. Like they can't let people see like, oh, this is what it is and this is what it, this is what it is and this is that. Like, oh I got punk the other day and this and that. I guess they can't. 
But then the thing is, I heard from everything is all over the place right now, as it's supposed to be, because this was just for last night. I think it's still even morning, or it's like early, early afternoon right now. But the thing is, like some guys just walk up and test people, and then, you know, they don't expect them to do anything. Like, I don't understand it. I really don't. Like, I just don't understand it. Like, I really trying to process, like, why would... I guess that's just the mindset. I don't know. I don't know. A lot of people mad over it, you know, all of that. But it just doesn't pay to stay in that mindset. It really doesn't. It, it really doesn't. Because you could be both something when you're at the bottom and you don't know, you don't have enough knowledge. And you're a little ignorant at that time. But listen, you got to want to, like, you got to see a little bit of something. If you make this much m amount of money and you with a different level of people, you have to understand that something is ignorant. You could be in ignorance and you don't know. But when you are at such a high level, you got to understand that some things, you just, sometimes you could just say, oh, I am, I am a dummy. But I guess that don't care for them. I, I don't know. And this is my real reaction. Like, like I don't understand it. You know, sometimes you just got to give up. You just got to give up. But that's the video. Hope you liked it. Hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you in the next one.